game? Yeah, 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 we did. I think the game got so out of reach. Um, you know, we had plans of playing Trey or some of the Wildcat. You know, we probably should have put him in there a lot, a lot more. Um, he's struggling. I just think it, it's a confidence thing. This is the way I see it on offense. We try to take shots down the field. We can't protect. We throw a quick game. They sit on our routes. Right. Um, we throw a quick game. They put their hands up and they bat balls down. Um, we can't run the ball. Uh, I think we like, what two or three times we had third and one, fourth and one. We can't get a yard. Um, so defensively, we're not the 85 Bears. We're not a, a strong defense. So when I think I have it here in the uh, in the first half. We went for on fourth down, on fourth down. Uh, we didn't get it. Uh, score one touchdown, punt, punt, fumble, and then the second half it was punt, interception, interception, touchdown, punt. And defensively, we, you know, we're not good enough to go back and stop people. I don't care who we're playing. We're just not that type of defense. So it's a bad formula. In terms of the defense, and I realize, you know, this was a very frustrating loss, but just a comment on the defense, it seemed like the secondary, you know, got beat a few times yep. once again. Yeah, yep. yeah, we had uh, Treshawn Johnson got beat. I mean, Treshawn Nixon got beat uh, on a wheel route by the running back. Uh, Darian Johnson had a, had a mental breakdown on one of their touchdowns. Um, you know, Cam got beat. I think four, I think they got either four touchdowns, or three or four touchdowns off of our turnovers, of mm -hmm. us, you know, giving the ball. So um, it's just, it's a bad formula right now. We're, uh, it's, it's frustrating and it's embarrassing, but, you know, we got to go through it. And then not to single anyone out because we know it's a team loss, but in terms of Austin Franklin, that was a key play in the game, the fumble, the, the muff punt. Did you feel like that was, you guys had momentum at that point, you know what I mean? I mean, could you talk about, I know you don't want to single anyone out, but. Yeah, I mean, just on that particular pay, uh, play, it's a, it's a Peter Peter call. So anytime it's a short punt, he, he has to yell out Peter Peter to get everybody away from the ball. And then he swears, and you, you, we'll see on tape that it hit one of their guys, but at the end of the day, they got the ball. And, you know, those, that was a critical part again because we had some pretty good momentum going at that time. Now, does it just kill the morale going 28 points on that, sir? No question. No doubt. Because now you start questioning yourself, and now you're fractured. Um, and then you look back at our last two games that we didn't play very well. Um, and then all of a sudden, it's the mindset, here we go again. So that's just, um, that's just the mindset of a losing team right now. And when things aren't going good, um, things don't go good for us. Um, can we expect to see Trey Cola play some more throughout the year? Yeah, we're going to have a pretty uh, in-depth staff meeting tomorrow, and it, it'll be A to Z, and we got to really look at uh, everything in our program right now. Um, so just uh, just unfortunate, and it's too bad to put it all on Andrew because you hate to put it all on him, but at the, at the end of the day, um, he's our quarterback, and Maybe it's unfair to put it all on me, but I'm the head coach and I'm a big boy, I can take it. But it starts with me, down to the coordinators, to the assistant coaches, to the players. So this is a team uh, malfunction, I guess you could say. We, uh, we gotta figure something out here, or this is gonna be a disaster. Jake D. Davis Cazares, questions for Davis. Tough game, talk about it. Um, well, when and uh, I mean we were doing good in the first couple of drives and uh, we uh, we gave up a couple of explosive plays that um, really we we really shouldn't have given up and I mean that's that's just I mean no matter what if, if you're giving up plays that guys are wide open that kills defense. You guys gave up big touchdowns from 48, 33, and 82. Was it them executing or you guys miscommunicating? It was it was all it was all us. We were. Uh, Miscommunicating, uh, not taking anything away from them. They, they called good plays, and I mean they got us, but we we should have covered those routes and covered those uh, that run that the quarterback kept. Uh, I mean that that's something that we we do every day in practice, and we should execute it better.
Anything else for Dave? We're back Andrew Manley. Questions for Andrew? It's obviously a frustrating game. I mean, that's just the bottom line. I mean, what, what questions can we possibly ask? You know, I mean, it's a very frustrating loss, I'm sure. No, it's very frustrating, you know, because as a team, all we, we, we put in work, you know, we're excited, we're confident, we put in a lot of work, watch a lot of film, and just to go out and have this happen, this is really hard, you know, as a team, and especially as me, you know, I, put the, I like to put the offense on my back, and to have a game like that, it's just, I put a lot of pressure on myself to have good games and lead the team, and it's just, it's just hard to have a game like that, and three turnovers myself, and I like, I like to put a lot of it on me, so I just want to apologize, too, for having a bad game, and just know that we're gonna we're gonna come out. We're gonna keep fighting no matter what, no matter what our schedule uh, record is. And each week we're gonna come out even harder. We're not gonna give up as a team. That's for sure. This, we're just gonna keep going out and just just believe that we're gonna keep competing this year. Talk about how their defense disrupted your offense. You know, five stacks, two interceptions, two fumbles. They just had a good game. Not I don't know much. And we were ready. We were prepared. We knew what they were gonna do, and they just played good. You know. Not much else, like I said. There were two bad passes. Uh, I didn't protect the ball stepping up in the pocket. Those three were on me. And not much else I can say about that. It's just that I did it myself on the three of them. Where is the confidence level with the team, Andrew? I, mean, I didn't think after last week it would be very high, and I knew this would be a tough game, but where is that confidence mm -hmm. level? Oh, uh, we take Sunday to just a rest and then come back, but the confidence went high going into last week's practice. and. You know, Coach Walker does a great job of just getting us back on track and just believing that we can do it and just take one game at a time. We looked at this game as just the all in all record. It's the first game of the whack. So that's why we were that's how we took it this week and I feel like we're just gonna come back in on Monday, you know. This team fights. They they don't give up. And that's how it is all year and I feel like that's what we're gonna do and we're just gonna keep fighting. We're still gonna be hungry for wins and we're just gonna keep competing. Thank you, Andrew. All right, man. Thank you. Thank you.